Hi guys, Shimmy here. Back again. Second one of the day. So this is part three um, on Fred Henry's appreciation build. Now, we got the dazzles on, got her painted. Uh, didn't follow the dazzles the exact because it changed the trucks around. This being the first truck and then the other truck are slightly different. Now, this is the original one out of the AMT kit. This is the first one. Now, decimal options, there was a pile of decimals here to choose from. So I can't wait. You can probably not see it. Most of them are glare. But they are there. There's white stripes down the bottom here. They have to go up and over it. So they go on maybe some stage tomorrow before I do the clear out. Um, so I tried to follow the decimals pattern here as close as possible. The doors are okay. So we've got it on the doors and the front fenders. Front wings depends on where you're from. Um, back end of the... the the bed itself slightly different so you weren't going to get that uh genuine forward parts up in the corner right here or choosy on the pickup itself the back so i moved it down the stone to a wheel arch um got those decimals in reasonably okay um the bottom one here which i just can't make out number seven it is on it i don't know what that is in seven um well this one here Let's see, you probably will get that back. I probably might be able to get that up in the top corner here, maybe. Number seven. Well, I'll try and keep it in camera. Top corner. So, I don't want to have it all up. I don't want too many dazzles over it. Make it look terrible looking. So, I might put that one up in here just to break that corner up. Um, let's see, the rest of them are on fine. Uh, bonnet. The racing team on the bonnet there, as you can see. Uh, now it's all to get clear, so I'll clear it tomorrow. That's it. It's, it's a satin red now at the minute. But, um, I'll give it a clear coat tomorrow once it rains, it's all settled down. So we really want to get it mocked together. So we'll have, we've got the interior painted here. I'll just show you that in a second here. Or when I, so we've got the bonnet, or sorry, I'm getting bonnet from. I've um, got the dashboard done. I'm um, getting interference of lights there for some reason. Um, now I'm going to give it a satin coat. So that there is number X57. I've done that in. Buff. Um, give it a clear a matte finish. Just to protect that uh, dull finish on uh, the buff. Before we put our decimals on. And cut what we uh, lights here now with the chrome. Or satin, silver, one or the other. And we get our decimal in. And our SMD. For it to light up the dashboard. Door cards. Um. Again, they got the satin finish on them. Now there's a big dazzle goes over the whole door, more or less. Um, where is it? It's just here. So there's a couple of these, there's one, there's wee, two wee speakers down the bottom here. So they're going to have the pencil in between black and silver. Now those here actually go over the door panels. There's your ring cut out for the speaker. Let's see if that one. Those are their seats, back seats, and then the front, one or the other. Um, I think it's for the dice. Just, I can't be sure. Let me check the instructions. And then we've got this for our bed. Um, bed sitting off camera here in the booth. So I know the steps now are done black. I'm not too worried about colors is because your tassel is going to go over it anyhow. Um, radiators sitting there. We got our chassis near enough finish. We got our discs and pelt calibers and all on it. So I'm not enough now that it's turned out. So I'm. Um, there's no more tassels of what I can see here. It has to go on anywhere. I might just double check before we start putting things up. So I'll get all the SMDs made for it some stage tomorrow. There's not that many in this. And there's only two at the back. And I think there's what? What over here? Four at the front. You've got two headlights and two indicators just down the bottom. Now, regarding the wheels, these are wheels for the first truck. Uh, the wheels and tires are in the other bag for the AMT kit. I should have had this out. Sorry, guys. Now, you have a couple of choices here. I don't know where you're going to make them out. So got, I think these ones are for the, the Cobra itself, the spoke wheels. And, and then you've got those, some very similar to those wheels there. A wee bit thicker on the bars. But um, as I said yesterday, I think the white is going to look nice in this. Um, the white walls. But the only thing is, they won't fit onto this tire, this rim. They're just too thick and there's no, not a mission of getting them over it. So I might have to change the wheels out 
over to those chrome ones if I decide to go for the, the white walls because as I say the white walls really do look nice on it rather than having those like kind of a modern um, rims on it with a low profile tires I don't know I'll make a set up and try and each set on and we'll see what it's like and we'll take it from there but anyway um, I'm going to start the cobra tomorrow to itself uh, I've got that set aside there's a lot of lens in this here, a lot of panel, or sorry, I'm getting panel lens from. A lot of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Lots of words here. Uh, mode lines along the back here, down the front, and so forth, and just the edge of the bonnet. So they're all going to have to be flattened out. Same as with that, I had a, little, I had a couple of lanes up around the front fenders and so forth, and then around the back wasn't too bad, but this is a hell of a lot worse. So we'll get that ready for priming and stuff tomorrow. And we'll get hopefully get into some kind of color tomorrow red again sorry so as i say on um, back seats or sorry front seats here that big dazzled or is it out there so i'm going to set things down don't know where i'm putting them that gray actually goes on to the seat i think it's a wee badge or something or so forth so forth some can goes up in the middle i think it's a wee maybe ford album or something i just don't know i can't see it here yeah there is i think it's a wee ford album Number 20, it's very small. I think it's four. No, it's just foose. Actually, sorry, beg your pardon. Just there at the end of my my finger here. Number, number 20. So I'll go up in the top corner. Right, guys. How do you go? Um, so we'll get it clear tomorrow and we'll get those cross members all cut out of it. So I was using them just to, for the pegs to hold it on and so forth. See if that big cross member in the front and I know the, the grill. I'm debating how to do the um there's another part here that hasn't done red or black. I just got to double check here again now before I start putting things up. So I think I'm colours are all gonna tie them well with it. Um once I get the rest of the detail paint on around that and then the tassels and so forth and then them rims on, I just think it's gonna look really well. So thoughts and ideas guys, um, do you think you should go for the white walls or just go for those big ones here, the low profile tires, it's just off camera there, no ones, anyway, no problem, so there we are guys, um, still on right to this, this rebuild, don't have any, I haven't had any problems yet as such, um, touch wood, um, the rest of the build will go together. Uh, reasonably fine. Now I said that we haven't touched any of the, uh, the AMT kit yet at all, so only time will tell. Right, guys, no problem. As I said, I'll speak to you all later, and thanks for watching.